what's up guys and welcome to the video. So special thanks to Hoshek Motor Mercedes-Benz dealer. It's located in Brno in Czech Republic and also here is a AMG Performance Center. This is C43 AMG Coupe and yes, it is with AMG Performance exhaust and this specific car is in brilliant blue color. So guys, this will be full review, exterior interior and exhaust note. So if you enjoy this video, if you like this content, then please subscribe. Turn the notification bell on and if you have any more questions, leave them in the comments section down below. So yeah guys, let's start. So in the front we can see double blade, twin blade, AMG grill. And these like aero bits, but those are not working. Only this on the side which is going through, but these are blind multi beam led full led headlights and yeah this is brilliant blue color this is the key it can be also in white color and also in gloss black On the side you can see by turbo formatic badge black mirrors cameras for assists this is panoramic roof keyless entry little spoiler on the boot lid So this version is like an entry AMG for C-Class. Then you have also 63 AMG and 63 S, the most powerful one. So this has four exhaust pipes and diffuser in gloss black. And I really like how this looks. You can see a head-up display here. So let's check out these tires. So these are Dunlop Sport Max run flat tires, I believe RT. And these are 255, 35R19, so 19 inch wheels. I really like the design of these rims. So let's check out the engine space. So this is the V6 3 liter AMG engine and it produces 390 horsepower and there is also 9G speed shift gearbox, so 9 gears and this car can sprint from 0 to 100 kilometers or 62 miles per hour in 4.7 seconds so exactly the same as A35 AMG and this has 90 horsepower more but also is heavy car so this is AMG entry model and in 63 or 63S you have hand built engine from a Falterbach Germany windshield wipers are hidden a little bit here and on this side is car battery 
So even this is entry AMG level car. It's quite powerful and this would be great daily AMG. And maybe you need to know, maybe you know, 43 AMG can be only as a formatic and 63 can be only as rear wheel drive. So if you need car which you want will drive also in during winter, then you want this car, not the 63. I mean, you can drive 63 on snow tires, but if it's heavy snow, then uh, this will be better for heavy snow. All right, guys, so check out. Let's check out the interior by Turbo Formatic. And you have this nice animation of the C-Class carbon fiber decor. So this is the facelifted C-Class and it has this digital interior with new 12 inch multimedia display. So it really looks nice. It's in old instrument cluster. So if you like old style instrument cluster, but you want new digital interior and then this is a great car for you so let's put it in a sport plus and let's start the car also as i said this car has a performance exhaust so this button so the startup is quite loud So this is the new AMG steering wheel with AMG logo and a red stripe on the top. More straight on the sides or flat. And with this panel you control this instrument cluster and with this you control the command. So I'm going to show you now what you can set here. So you can set different style. Right now it's in sport. You can have it in super sport. And also you can have it in a classic. So my favorite is super sport then sport and last would be the classic and it really looks great with the speedo it's like a 3d because uh, take a look at the numbers they have like a shadow behind them so it looks like it's a 3d really great design from amg so what you can set here is let's take a look from this side service so you can see if you have some error messages you would see them here tire pressure but you need to drive for that this is for service coolant consumption assistance this is for the tronic and attention assist if you need a brake performance G force then settings for the car suspension exhaust stabilization and boost also temperature of the engine and gearbox and here you can see how much you are using kilowatt and Newton meters then in trip, you can see range, consumption, eco display, how much is from start and from reset. Then you have navigation, radio, media, telephone, head up display. So you can see and select position of the head up display.
then you can select brightness so you can see it better during sunny day then you can select display content what do you want to see there for example this looks really great and you can set it to different styles you can have lap times with track pace so then you can select different like sport and it would look different you would have two instrument clusters and it would look a little bit different but uh, you can also change the right instrument cluster so this is AMG track pace so as you can see many many settings this is for, uh, for uh, navigation re-guidance but my favorite is still the super sport and we can also change in super sport this right part and also this part so here you have heated seats you can have also ventilated seats Burmaster sound system the best sound system a beautiful carbon fiber decor climate control unit and 12.12 .12 inch display these are the comfort seats you can have also the AMG performance seats so this is great but still they have a lot of support here So in the glove box is this much space, quite a lot actually. So here we have two cup holders, wireless charging for your phone, a USB port and on the top you can open the panoramic sunroof. Beautiful animation. So the armrest space quite deep with two USB ports and SD card slot. Beautiful red stitching. And there you can see the ambience lighting. I shot C43 estate and there I showed you full review of the command system of this display so link in the description box so make sure you check it out you can set different driving modes so you can have slippery with the snowflake icon in individual you can set what you want comfort sport sport plus and then you can also set here the exhaust button auto start stop this is a uh, parktronic volume this is for manual gear changes adaptive suspension amg ride control and this is for stabilization with this you control command display so here you can see temperature of the engine and gearbox and on the left side you have a adjustment for lights for multi-beam auto these are the main headlights parking lights this is a trick how you can light up only one side of the car and leave it like that for parking make sure you check out my mercedes trick video link down in the description box this is for the distronic pilot turn off parking seat belt so you can press it and car will give you the seat belt 
these are the fog lights and you can lock the car here so guys I'm not going in the back because next to this car is another car and I don't want to scratch it it's hard to uh, even get in the car but I can see I can tell you how much is legroom here and it's plenty so also behind me and also a lot of space above head so I think I can fit there no problem and I'm uh, 186 centimeters so more than average tall, per tall person nice panoramic sunroof so it's really great so guys let's check out the boot space so you can open the boot from the key and the boot is decently large you can fit suitcases here no problem you can lock it and also close it so guys that's it for this video if you like this video let me know in the comment section down below give this video a like if you like it and subscribe to my youtube channel and guys I'll see you soon in the next video. Have a great day.